Hi, this is Frank Taylor with Nature at Your Door. And as you can see, it's a fall weekend here in the Appalachian Mountains. It probably comes a little bit earlier at my house than I am just outside my door. I'm actually on my driveway at my home here at about 2,700 feet in the Appalachian Mountains. Around me are a variety of different tree species. There's a natural backdrop and some trees that I planted myself. This episode is going to be a myth-busting episode. We're used to talking about deciduous trees. And when we say deciduous trees, we say, oh, those are trees whose leaves fall off in the fall. And that's why we call it fall. Then we have evergreen trees. And the misconception here is that we think, oh, evergreen trees, they keep their leaves year round. They don't lose their leaves. Well, actually, evergreen trees do lose their leaves. And so in this episode, I'm going to talk about how and why. Right here in your backyard, you never know what you're going to find. I'm going to use the white pine trees that are here around me. There's some over here and some behind me to illustrate the fact that evergreen trees actually do drop their needles. And the white pine tree is the easiest to identify because it's the only pine tree with five needles in a bundle. On this uh, pine branch here, the needles that are the newest are the ones on the end. In fact, these new needles are produced in the spring. Other needles, when they reach two to three years old, will actually turn yellow, then turn brown and fall off the tree. It's most dramatic for white pine trees at this time of the year in the fall. And you can see in this tree right here that the leaves are turning yellow. You can see needles turning yellow underneath the tree. You can see that the needles have dropped. Here on the driveway, you can see the needles piling up and are blown by the wind. So the white pine tree is an evergreen tree. It does stay year green year round, but it does lose needles. And the needles that, you, that it loses are about two to four years old. And this varies from tree to tree and from species to species. Of the pines, the drop of the needles uh, is probably most dramatic here in the white pine. Other pines and firs and spruces will also lose their needles, but it will be gradual and it's on different times of the year. Again, most dramatic for the white pine. Why do they lose the needles? Well, as the needles age, they'll produce less sugars. Their photosynthesis is reduced. They're not as efficient in doing photosynthesis. So the tree will shed those in favor of adding new pine needles that will show up at the ends of branches as the tree grows. So if you have a pine tree and it's losing needles and some of them are turning yellow, you don't need to worry. However, if those needles are being lost on the ends or the needles are browning or turning yellow or falling off on the ends, then you may have a problem that might be related to fungus, insects, or other uh, predators of the pine tree. So in this myth-busting episode, we learned that evergreen trees do drop their needles or leaves just like deciduous trees do. It's just not as dramatic. And remember, it varies from species to species, both in how long the needles last on a particular tree and when they drop and how that sequence works throughout the year. I hope you enjoyed this fall episode about deciduous trees and evergreen trees. And remember, if you like my channel, please subscribe, give me a like, and leave me a comment. I love hearing from my viewers. And remember, I cover all things nature, from frogs, toads, snakes, turtles, the myriapoda, insects, trees, wildflowers and fungi. I cover all the things you might encounter just outside your door. But thanks again for watching this fall episode of Nature at Your Door. <laughs>